Unit 3, Lesson 5, Comparing Speeds and Prices. Number 1. Mai and Priya were on scooters. Mai traveled 15 meters in 6 seconds. Priya travels 22 meters in 10 seconds. Who was moving faster? Explain your reasoning. To figure out how fast Mai was traveling per second, I'm going to do 15 divided by 6. And to figure out how fast Priya travels per second, I'm going to do 22 divided by 10. 15 divided by 6 is 2, with 3 left over, 6. 3 6 is the same as 1 half. So Mai can travel 2.5 meters in 1 second. 22 divided by 10 is 2, with 2 over 10 remaining. 2 over 10 is the same as 1 fifth. Priya can travel 2 and 1 fifth meter per second. Mia traveled two and a half meters per second, so that's faster. Mia traveled faster than Priya. Number two. Here are the prices for cans of juice that are the same brand and the same size at different stores. Which stores offer the best deal? Explain your reasoning. Store X offers four cans for $2.48. So I'm going to divide $2.48 by four. Store Y offers five cans for $3. So I'm going to divide $3 by five. Store Z offers the cans at 59 cents each. Four cans for $2.48 is the same as one can for 62 cents. Five cans for $3 is the same rate as one can for 60 cents. Store Z offers the best deal at 59 cents per can. Number three, cost of homes can be very different in different parts of the United States. A, a 450 square foot apartment in New York City costs $540,000. What is the price per square foot? Explain or show your reasoning. To determine the price per square foot, I'm going to divide $540,000 by 450. I can do this a little bit easier by canceling out each of these zeros and now it reads 54,000 divided by 45. 54,000 divided by 45 is 1,200. The price per square foot is $1,200. B. A 2,100 square foot home in Cheyenne, Wyoming cost $110 per square foot. How much does this home cost? Explain or show your reasoning. 2,100 square feet times $110 per square foot. 2,100 times 110 is $231,000. The home in Cheyenne, Wyoming costs $231,000. Number four, there are 33 and 8 tenths fluid ounces in a liter. There are 128 fluid ounces in a gallon. About how many liters are in a gallon? Well, they're not asking for a precise answer, so I can estimate. I'm going to change 33.8 to 30 to make it easier, and I'm going to change 128 to 130 to make it easier. So 130 divided by 30 is about four with a little bit left over. So the answer that I'm gonna select is C, four. Is your estimate larger or smaller than the actual number of liters in a gallon? Explain how you know. Well, when I actually did the division, the answer was closer to three and seven tenths. So is my estimate larger or smaller than the actual number? Yes, my answer was more than the actual number. Since my estimate was 4 and the actual number was closer to 3 and 7 tenths. Number 5. Diego is 165 centimeters tall. Andre is 1 and 7 tenths meters tall. 
Who is taller, Diego or Andre? Explain your reasoning. Well, when you compare 165 centimeters with 1.7 meters, 1.7 meters is actually 170 centimeters. 170 centimeters is taller than 165 centimeters. Andre is taller than Diego. Number six, name an object that could be about the same length as each measurement. A, four inches, that's a pen. B, six feet, that's a surfboard. C, one meter, that's a window. D, five yards, that's a truck. E, six centimeters, that's a toothpick. F, two millimeters, that's a flea. G, three kilometers, that's a beach. Congratulations, you have completed unit three, lesson five, comparing speeds and prices.